India, the Northern Mountains. Look at the physical map of India. You can see the mountainous region in the north. The region stretches from Jammu and Kashmir to Arunachal Pradesh. These mountain ranges in the north are the Himalayas. The Himalayas that pass through Nepal are called the Central Himalayas. There are three Himalayan ranges that are parallel to each other. From south to north, they are Shivalik, Himachal and Great Himalayas. From Shivalik to Great Himalayas, the ranges increase in height, which means they get taller. We also have the Ladakh, Zaskar and Karakoram ranges in the western Himalayas. Ladakh is in Jammu and Kashmir. Karakoram lies over Gilgit, Baltistan and Ladakh. Zaskar lies in the eastern part of Jammu and Kashmir. There are many lakes in the Himalayan region due to melting snow. The largest lake is the Panagong So Lake, which extends from India to China. The lake is 5 kilometers wide. There are a few passes in the Himalayan ranges. Passes are gaps in the mountain through which we can pass. Sipkila is a pass in Himachal Pradesh on the Indo-China border. Jalepla is a pass in Sikkim on the Indo-Tibet border. There are many high peaks in the Himalayas. K2 is the highest peak in India. It lies in the part of Kashmir that is now occupied by Pakistan. Gashar Brahm, Nanda Devi, Nangar Parbat, are some of the other high peaks in the Himalayan ranges. The height of the Himalayas goes on reducing as we go towards the east. Kanchanjunga is the highest peak in the eastern Himalayas and the third highest peak in the world. In fact, until 1852, people thought that Kanchanjunga was the highest mountain in the world. Many North Indian rivers have their origin in the Himalayas. The river Ganga originates from the Gangotri Glacier which is in the Uttarakhand region of the Himalayas and is the largest glacier. However, due to global warming, the glacier is retreating. It will probably completely melt by 2030 and the people of India will start suffering from famine and drought. The Indus, Brahmaputra, Yamuna are other rivers that originate in the Himalayas. Patkoi, Naga, Lushai are known as eastern ranges of the Himalayas. The Garo, Khasi and Jainshya ranges are on the Meghalaya plateau. These are the mountainous regions of the north. The Himalayas have had a great effect on the climate of India. It stops the cold, dry, arctic wind and keeps northern India warm. It blocks the monsoon winds and makes sure India gets rainfall. The Himalayas have acted as a barrier between India and China and so totally different cultures have evolved on two sides of the ranges. They also protected the Indians from the Mongol invaders who could not cross the Himalayas and expand their kingdom in India.